Hello friends, today I will be trying to extract some potassium nitrate and barium nitrate from gunpowder. The source of the gunpowder is some fireworks. These are pretty common and uh, in India you can find about 10 for around 1 dollar that is 60 rupees. Interesting thing is that the composition states that it contains around 70% of nitrates and a remaining percent of aluminium powder and sulfur so we can separate the aluminium and sulfur by some common methods which can be performed at home so let's get started so once you have extracted the gunpowder i will be using this container to store it so first let's take the readings of the mass of the container it's about 30 grams it's a good idea to write all the data so 30 grams now we'll be using this gunpowder just let me transfer this in the container so let's say once you have extracted or uh, transferred the gunpowder into the container again weigh the mass now this time it's around 70 grams hope you can see yeah 70 now let's just quickly fill the data uh, oh sorry 70 minus 30 40 grams sorry now let's just now let's do the further calculation we got 40 grams of gunpowder and of that 75 percent is nitrate there is nothing specified on the box so i took it the percentage as weight by weight so in 100 grams we get 75 percent of nitrate that is 75 grams and then in 40 grams we get x i just found out the x it came out to be 30 grams now amount of potassium nitrate present in 40 grams is 45 percent so 45 upon 100 into 40 gives 18 grams of potassium nitrate and of barium nitrate it gives me around 12 grams now i googled for solubility at 20 degrees celsius and the, so the solubility of barium nitrate is 8.7 grams and that of potassium nitrate is 31.6 grams so according to me around 200 ml of water is enough to dissolve all the salts completely we have our gunpowder and the pointer is set to zero i have some water i will be adding slowly so that it reaches around 200 150 more 50 ml yes 200 so now we need to mix the gunpowder completely in water just shake it it will work after mixing the solution you will get a dense colored liquid so I am going to filter it using my homemade filter it's a pet bottle with its neck upside down with a circular newspaper cutout nothing special pour the solution and then filter it now once the solution is filtered you just need to evaporate the water to get your nitrates now here the water is evaporating and uh, you will get some solid crystals of your nitrates after evaporation you will get some crystals like this and that's how 
you make potassium nitrate at home and here is the final product unfortunately <laughs> i just got around 15 grams whereas 30 was expected that's fine it was a good experiment now thank you for watching you can try this at home and be safe and leave a like if you like this kind of videos then please subscribe thanks for watching